and lacks and today I'm going to give you some tips on coloured hair. As you can see I've got quite bright dark red hair so how do I keep it in such good condition and how do I keep the colour lasting for longer? Well firstly it all starts when you get your hair done. As soon as you get your hair done try not to wash it for I would say at least a week because the colour's still settling then and it's at its strongest so whenever you wash it it's just going to come straight out which leads me on to my next point. Try to wash it as little as you possibly can. I know some people they like to wash their hair every day and they just can't be doing with greasy hair but the more you wash it the more the colour is just going to run straight out. So a handy tip is use Batiste. I absolutely love Batiste. I use it probably about three days into having washed my hair and then that will keep me going for maybe another two another two or three days. So I only wash my hair maybe every five to seven days. Um, like I said I know some people might find that revolting or whatever but it works for me. I have quite thick long hair and even styling it would take a good two hours so it's easier for me just to wash it as little as possible and use batiste. I find uh, with washing it as little as possible that the colour doesn't really tend to drain as much. Um, this has been probably over a month since I've last had my hair dyed and it's still quite bright. So my other tip is use special colour shampoo and special colour conditioner. Other products aren't meant for coloured hair which means they may be harsher on the hair and lead it to strip more. Especially shampoos which are meant for cleansing and cleansing product build up. Um, so I would use these ones. This is Garnier Fructus Colour Care Shampoo and it smells absolutely gorgeous and it's meant for your colour to last longer. And this is the Colour Care Colour Last Conditioner. So they're meant for coloured and highlighted hair and I find they work best on darker colours. So if you're blonde, stick to your normal blonde shampoo. But this, these tips are purely reserved for darker colours, so your reds, your dark browns, your blacks, because they do tend to fade quite a lot and just run straight down the drain. So I would also say when you're washing your hair, don't use too hot water. If you use really hot water, it'll just strip your hair straight out. And I know it sounds really hard saying wash your hair in freezing cold water. Come on, I live in Scotland. It's absolutely freezing at the moment. I'm not suggesting going for cold showers. If at the end of your shampoo and conditioner you can just run it on to just quite cold water, colder than lukewarm, just for 30 seconds or something it will seal your colour in. Also try to refrain from using too many heated products, again the heat will start stripping your hair. I've noticed this a lot on people who say they have quite curly hair and they only straighten their fringe and you'll find that the fringe starts stripping a lot more and fading a lot faster. So I hope those tips have helped and let me know how you get on. Bye!